Welcome to episode three, Behind the Alliance Wall. I'm Matt, and I'm joined by Derek to show you what to expect in the player stations. Each alliance has three identical player stations. Each team gets its own player station with a shelf for their operator console. The shelf has a two inch strip of hook and loop tape, loop side up, centered on it. There's an ethernet cable that connects you to the field management system and allows you to control your robot during the match. The starting line is four feet behind the alliance wall. Everyone has to stay behind it during autonomous mode. There's no back line this year, but you must stay on the carpet during the match. The match starts with 45 white and six colored discs in each alliance station. The feeder stations are made of clear polycarbonate outlined in your color. Watch out for the scoring equipment for the low goal. Each player station has a string of LEDs. Green lights mean it's safe for people to enter the field. When the lights go off, the match is about ready to begin and you must exit the field immediately. Yellow lights mean your robot's climb has been ruled invalid by a ref. Now you've seen behind the alliance wall. Be sure to check out all of our other field tour videos.